Hey, water signs. Thank y'all so much for being here with me, tuning in and tapping in. Y'all already know who and what it is, so let's just get into your, your message. What's going on with y'all today? Let's see what message Spirit has for y'all today. But y'all already know the messages are general. So take what resonates and leave what does not. They're also timeless here. Water signs. So whenever you come across the message, that is when Spirit has it for you. Thank y'all to all of my subscribers, old and new. Y'all are the absolute bomb. Thank y'all so much for the support, real shit. Some of y'all water signs, it could be an um, Aries or a Leo involved in y'all's situation. But let's get into y'all's message here. I'm here to control your emotions. So today, water signs is very important for y'all to control your emotions because I feel like a lot of erratic, irrational behavior happening today. So let's get into here. This could be you. This could be somebody you're dealing with. This could just be energy surrounding y'all. Yeah, high priestess comes out here. Intuition today, water signs is going to be your best friend. Ace of Cups. Some of y'all are meeting somebody new or someone new has come into your life. Yeah. And you don't really know what, what's going on with this person. Spirit is telling you to trust your, your intuition here because it's never going to fail you. Yeah. We got the page of swords in the reverse and the seven of pentacles is in the reverse. Mm. The first thing I, um, I heard when I saw those two cards was put your defenses down and don't overthink this. Yeah, it's like, don't jump in head first. Let your intuition guide you with whatever this situation is. Um, water signs. Don't be guarded to the information that spirit is trying to give you about this person. Yeah, ten of cups. Because I see some of y'all, I see some of y'all already wanting to reject the offer. You can't make it up. Yeah, spirit is telling you to use your intuition. This could have something to do with someone you have a family with. Yeah, Ten of Pentacles and the Ten of Cups. Spirit wants you to actually like put your defenses down. Don't overthink this situation. Trust the information that's being given to you. I don't know. I don't know why we don't have the Three of Pentacles out here. But that's what's going on here because something here, it could be really, really good. I feel like somebody here, I don't know what happened in the past, but it feels like something here, your mind is playing tricks on you possibly. Oh, it's giving me more for the water signs. But it's just trust your intuition with whatever situation this is. Yeah, eight of pentacles here. Yeah, because some of y'all are receiving very specific downloads here. Yeah, ten of swords here. I feel like y'all standing in y'all own way, seriously. That's why spirit is telling you to put your uh your guard down here. Hmm. Cause some of y'all are focusing on what happened to you previously. Yeah, back then I feel like you didn't ignore the you you ignored the red flags. Spirit is telling you as long as you trust your intuition and don't ignore the red flags, you're gonna be good here. Yeah. We got the nine of swords, and then we got the four of wands. Real anxious, nervous energy coming through here because somebody feels like somebody is going to do them the same way that they did them in the past. That's why they don't want to give this person a chance or whatever this situation is. This could even be involving a pregnancy. Hmm. Like somebody here, they don't even want to embrace the thought of being pregnant because, you know, before they got really happy about this situation and then something went wrong. Yeah, eight of cups here. Hmm. Water signs, at this time, I also need y'all to keep a very close eye on y'all children because something is coming through about somebody's child running away from home. And also, this is something about leaving somebody at the altar. I don't know what this is. Is somebody going through like a separation? It feels like separation anxiety. Yeah, something here is coming to an end or a deed. I don't know what's going on here. Scorpio energy coming through here. But it feels like a real self-sabotage energy here is what I'm seeing. Yeah, Leo energy here. Something here could happen with a Leo that some of y'all are still holding on to. And this is what's causing you to be very defensive against this, whatever is coming in or, you know, spirit is trying to tell you something about whomever this is coming towards you or whatever this is, uh, water signs. 
Somebody here also needs to accept the fact that somebody is gone and they are not coming back. Yeah, it could be a, a, a Leo here. This person was a, a backstabber, betrayer anyway. So it feel like spirit moved them out of your way so you can have this Ten of Cups, Ten of Pentacles situation come in towards you. Keep going here. Water yeah, but it's sun. You know what? If we got the sun card. It's something here that's going to make you very happy after this betrayal. Yeah, and it's happening suddenly. Mm. I feel like, honestly, some of y'all, it's like you're up all night long, so you really can't even think about this situation clearly. You're overthinking this situation, seriously. Yeah, the hangman here. And you're keeping whatever this situation is on hold. Holy Spirit, give me one more. Yeah, the five of cups here. I feel like, honestly, some of y'all are going to walk away from a situation here that could be really good to you because you're thinking about something here that happened to you in your past. Yeah, something here could be about social media here. I don't know if y'all meeting somebody on social media. Yeah, y'all are meeting somebody new on social media. Empress energy coming through. But because of something y'all went through in y'all past with somebody, you know, um, it feels like y'all are really close off to this person. Spirit is telling you to trust your intuition when it comes to this person. Yeah, it could be an Aquarius, Sagittarius, Libra, Taurus. There's that Leo again. But let's clarify your reading real quick. Yeah, you don't know if somebody's telling you the truth or, you know, what their real intentions are here. Just trust your intuition and consult with spirit. Yeah, because somebody, they say they have a lot of emotions for you, but mm, I don't know. The last person said the same thing, right? Yeah, so you on the fence with how you're going to deal with this situation, how you really feel about this person or the situation itself. Yeah, and then we get the Five of Pentacles coming up in the reverse. But the Three of Cups coming up. Yeah, some of y'all, this could be somebody coming back from y'all past. Did this person do something to hurt you in the past? And that's why you're so closed off to this person. You could have a family with this person, have lived with this person. This person could have walked out on you for someone else. Yeah, but I feel like there's a real stuck energy here. Somebody here, they regret walking away from y'all. Honestly, water signs. They regret walking away from you. Because they see how it changed. The dynamic of y'all's relationship here. But water signs, I'm also feeling like whatever this is, it puts you on your spiritual journey. So that's why spirit is like, look, trust your intuition. You've done the work. Trust your intuition here. I mean, you have nothing to worry about. Because either way, you're going to be good. Holy Spirit. Thank you. <laughs> yeah, there's communication. Good news coming in here. Spirit wants you to be enthusiastic about whatever this new beginning is. Yeah, and then we got the Seven of Cups. And then we got the Four of Pentacles. This could even be about getting back out there and exploring your options here. Yeah. And then we got the moon card and then the eight of cups. Hmm. Oh, it feels like in your this this feels like this is what y'all are holding on to. Somebody here, they talked a good game with y'all, made y'all believe a lot of shit. So you actually were holding on to this person, not giving anybody a chance. It feels like, honestly, I'm not going to lie. It kind of feels like y'all missed out on a lot of opportunities, but one is being presented to you again. Yeah, because it's not like now you're trusting your intuition more, so it's like abandoned ship. Yeah, my phone just went off. A lot of y'all are leaving something behind, but coming into something um, even greater here. You're going from eight of cups. You're going from eight right to the ten. It's like everything you want is on the other side of this um, betrayal, this heartbreak water signs. Seeing through the fog, seeing through the illusions. Yeah. 
Five of Pentacles comes up in the reverse, leaving that lack mindset behind. Because mm -hmm. y'all deserve more than somebody that want to talk to y'all and spend time with y'all when it's convenient for them. Yeah, no. Yeah, Cancer energy coming through. It's time to choose you, fam. Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio, whomever. It's time to move forward. And that's what brings in these positive changes for you. Yeah, we got Capricorn energy right here. Yeah, because some of y'all, this could have been something that y'all were used to. This person right here, they um do something, say something, not putting in the work. You know, they walk away. You know, y'all having an argument or something. You know, they walk away, hang up the phone. Whatever this behavior pattern is, I don't know. But it's like this person right here, no, this was a routine. This was a behavior routine. Somebody here would purposely put y'all in y'all feelings and then watch to see how y'all would, you know, if it would hurt you, if you would cry, things like that. That's why spirit is like, no. But I feel like the guarded here is because of the past situation. It's time to let that go. Spirit is putting you on a completely different path because this is a path to success here. Some of y'all could be traveling here as well real soon. But wherever spirit is directing you to, trust me, fam, that's where you want to be because that's where you're going to feel like you belong. That's where, you, even though you know you're whole all by yourself, only other people can add to you. They can't make you whole. You're whole all by yourself. So some of y'all could be moving to, you know, just a place of contentment within yourself. But I feel like this is a love situation. It could be you walking away from somebody who showed you unrequited love to move into, you know, self-love, loving on you more. You're coming into union with yourself. But more so, I feel like this is somebody that's afraid to open up with some, to somebody because of something that happened in the past. Mm. Let's see, Holy Spirit, what other message do you have for me? Yeah, I feel like y'all moving from one situation where it kept you in your head to another situation where somebody going to be happy as hell to see you every damn day. And somebody else is going to be stuck in regret. Yeah, it could be an Aries here with the Emperor. It don't have to be, though. But somebody here, they're, they're going to... It's like, look, this person don't have no time to play games. They know what they want. They want you. You want them. Let's do the damn thing. Some of y'all could even be getting married here soon, Spirit is saying. Hold on, okay, water sign. Sorry about the interruption, but my baby woke up and he had to um, uh, come and tell me good morning. I know that's right. Yeah, but look, see, see, so this is what I'm saying. Some of y'all are learning to love on yourself. This spiritual journey that you're on, it has you loving on yourself so much that it's bringing in this new love. It's like the more you love on yourself, water sign, the more you become, uh, the more attractive you become to others. Without even trying, y'all pulling in a very, very solid person towards y'all. Yeah. Goodness, this is beautiful, water sign. And it all starts with you choosing you. Yeah, six of pentacles here. Some of y'all learn to open up to receive. You see what I'm saying? Y'all so used to giving. Step out of that masculine energy into your feminine energy and open up to receive her. Because somebody here, they want to share with you. Some of y'all could be having financial difficulties right now. Somebody wants to share with you. They're coming forward. They want to share with you. I'm getting like a truck driver here with this chariot car. Like somebody could drive big trucks or something like that. Yeah, but whomever this, I'm telling you, but whomever this is that drive the trucks, y'all, it's two different people coming through here. There's a Leo. Oh, there's a Leo coming through here. That'll give y'all, but there's still somebody else in the picture with this person. They they paint this beautiful picture. Don't have to be a Leo, but I'm just saying this person here, they feel like giving you money is what's gonna make you happy. No, it's like, damn, you frustrated. Spirit is trying to bring this other person in towards your water songs. But this person cannot come in until you fully let this situation go. I feel like this some y'all been in for a very long time. It's like you've been waiting on this person to push this forward and push this forward with you. 
And it just ain't happening, but you do love this person. But I'm telling you, Spirit got somebody brand new coming in towards y'all. But it's important for y'all to open up to receive this person, this blessing. Holy Spirit. Yeah, we get the nine to one. Somebody need to get some routine maintenance done on their car as well, water signs. Yeah, somebody could know y'all need a car, need some maintenance or something done on y'all car. I feel like they're going to help you out with that. That's what I'm saying. Somebody give y'all money, but they won't give you their heart. And that shit hurt. Yeah. But I'm telling you, it's it's possibly a fire sign or oh, earth sign. This person going to be very hurt, water signs, when you decide to leave. Yeah, it could even be a Gemini here. They're going to be hurt as hell once you decide to leave with the lovers. Because I feel like there's you're going to make a choice and it's not going to be this person. You're possibly, I said, open up to receive these blessings. Nine of Cups. Yeah, I feel like you're going to end some situation with this person and move right into the uh, another situation that Spirit actually has for you. But I'm telling you, getting on this spiritual journey, man, damn, it opened your ass up a lot. Like knowledge is power looking at. That's what I'm talking about, water signs. Well, let me get y'all one more card and get up out of here. I don't want to keep y'all. Holy Spirit. Water signs, please. Water signs. Yeah, King of Cups. That's what I'm saying. Y'all. <laughs> this somebody is coming in towards y'all. It could be another water sign. Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio. I really feel like y'all are blocking this person out or, you know, like being really stubborn, hard to deal with, things like that. It's because you don't trust the situation or something like that. But I feel like some of y'all are going to be torn between two people. This person that'll come through and give you money that really don't want to make a decision. Then you got somebody else over here who want to fucking marry you, actually show you love. Commitment, shit like that. So, water sign, it really feel like y'all finna have a major decision to make here. <laughs> so, yeah, that's been your reading. If it resonates, I ask you please hit the like button for me, comment, subscribe, share, all that good stuff, y'all. Personal readings are closed, but the 11-11 questions are open. If you would like to take advantage of that, look in the description box below, fam. That's where you will find all that information. I thank y'all so much. I'm so grateful, so appreciative to y'all for all y'all support. And everything else, y'all. I'm sending y'all love and healing energy wherever y'all are in this crazy ass world, water signs. And we'll definitely get back up.